Yo, 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 what's up, y'all? My name is Ray Nail Roy. Welcome back to my channel, Official Trips. We back from the vlog, y'all. It's a beautiful morning. Check it. I ain't been back here in this minute, man. I ain't been back at this spot in a minute. I'm at the Surfside Jetty. Surfside Jetty. I'm about to get them on it, man. I have a specific goal in mind. Sheephead. Sheephead. I'm catching sheephead today. That's it. That's it. I'm just catching sheephead today on the jetty. I know where they're at. I seen my um, compadres out there you know a while ago and I seen how they did it so I'm gonna do what they do and I'm gonna catch some fish alright hey man shout out to my boys um, they are on the jet here already from Kansas City Missouri man it's like five o'clock in the morning it's dark I have a group of men just walk up on me I'm like oh it's about to go down I'm from the hood y'all that's that's what I think and he was like hey man sorry I don't mean to bother you but we're from Kansas City Missouri I love your channel so shout out to my boys from Kansas City Missouri took a picture with y'all good looking out man love y'all too man so yeah man we're gonna get out on it Get some street head and kill it. Water looking kind of rough. Little caps. I ain't worried though. Let's get it done. Let's go! The fall is coming. I can feel it. Brings goosebumps to my skin. Tonight the whiskey feels stronger. Gasoline on hidden desires. So man so I'm out here bruh it's about five or six people out here let's talk about the weather it's about 55 degrees so in Texas this is pretty much literally a blizzard okay this is a snowstorm of 2022 at 55 degrees I can't feel my fingers right now on um, the wind about 10 to 15 northeast I don't know what the hell that means but if it helps you it helps you so with the wind coming northeast now we got some um, some water coming to kind of hitting the rocks okay um, I'm gonna be fishing right off the rocks because, like I said, I'm going for sheep head. Sheep head like to hang around the rocks. So since I'm gonna be fishing the rocks, that just means one thing. I'm gonna lose about three thousand dollars worth of gear today. That's right. I'm gonna lose about three thousand dollars worth of gear stuck on the rocks being hung up. <sighs> so right though, because what I'm gonna do is anything I catch, I'm bringing back to Houston. I'm eating it. Arr, arr, I'm eating it. Spending all this damn money. Ain't no catch and release here, B. So yeah, man, so I got about, what, half a mile walk to get to the end of the jetty. I'm already out of breath. I've been walking for about 10, 10 15 yards. But we gonna make it though. Got my gear, feeling good. The weather, weather looking kind of rough, but we're gonna get it done. Let me, let me show y'all what I'm talking about. Check it out. Y'all see that? Look at that. And on the other side, the channel, Look at that, nice and calm. That's the Quintana Jetty over there. I could have went to the Quintana Jetty because when the winds are going opposite of the jetty, it's totally flat over there, but I'm hard headed. I want to fish on this side because I can't. Let's go, let's go. These are the Kansas City, Missouri guys. I told you about I met this morning to picture with. See how they doing. Try to catch some bull red. Try it, man. Try it. Yeah. Yeah. It'll happen. I hope so. <laughs> Just gotta be patient. Yeah. It needs to warm up a little bit. Yeah, exactly. Where are you going up there? Yeah, I'm gonna go down to the end. All right. Um, if you hear me screaming for help, just call 911, hey, all right? <laughs> <laughs> all right, y'all, I know it's hectic windy, or hella windy. Uh, pro tip, if you ever come to the Surfside Jetty, be cautious of these rocks. I have a vlog, AKA episode, where I didn't know about that when I first came out here. Busting my behind, I was scarred up for weeks. So you gotta be careful. I got these exp expensive 
um, Sims boots with clicks. I got metal clicks. Give me a little better traction, but you still got to be cautious out here. So don't die. Don't die. Here we go. Oh, don't die, don't die, don't die. No, don't die, don't die, don't die. All right. So normally I want to fist this spot right here, but I might hit this area over here. Mark and I were here once and we did rather well. Right here off these rocks. Looks like it's a low tide, because normally you can't see all those rocks right there. I'm gonna try to cast over here first. If I can make it over here first. Oh yeah, that's slippery. Definitely slippery. All right. Just gonna take our time, baby. Oh my God. Oh shit. <laughs> Don't die right now. Don't die. If I die, I better get a million views on this video. There we go. Okay. Don't pull your hammy. Don't pull a hammy. No, 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 no. Okay. Okay. All right. We're good. We're good. Let's get set up. Let's talk about gear, baby. I got my old school ghetto pin 5,000 seven foot rod medium action. I'm gonna use my jetty setup. Have a bobber with adjustable, what, what the hell is my adjustable? Bobber, I can kind of mess around with the debt. Like a 12, 10 pound leader, some little weights, a little circle hook, some live shrimp. Trying to figure out if I land something, how can I get it up here? I brought my measuring board, I got my stringer, and then I'm gonna keep fish today without trying to die. Let's go. Whoa. Water down here. Right there, I can probably put my fish there. Oh, there goes my bobber. First bite, baby. Had a bite. Come back and get it, babe. Oh, there she go. There she go. Wait for it. There we go. We on, baby. Woo! We on, baby. First cast. Oh, it's a chipper. I think that's a, is that a ladyfish? That is a big ladyfish. Oh, my God. Y'all, look at this ladyfish. Holy smokes. I've never caught a ladyfish this big. It's a crazy turpin. Okay, okay. Y'all, look at this ladyfish. Unbelievable, y'all. Y'all see that? There she go. Wow. Oh my God. That was crazy. Look at that big dolphin. It'd be so dope if the dolphin tried to eat the bird. Do dolphins eat bird? Let me know. Do dolphins eat bird? I want to see this happen. Okay. Where y'all from where y'all be calling dolphins and porpoises? What the, what the hell is a porpoises? I don't even think that's a word, quite honestly. Alright. We're out the strike zone. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. If I catch that dolphin, I'm going to eat it. It is what it is. I drove a hundred miles from Houston to get here. So if I catch a dolphin, that's in God's plan. I'm sorry. It's getting eight. I bet the meat, magnificent. Let's go. I'm like 15 minutes later. There we go. All right, back to work. Oh 
like six. Nope. There we go. There we go. Here we go. Another ladyfish. <laughs> Bro, what is up with these damn ladyfish? And he is not happy, but we got him, baby. We got him. We got him. <sighs> Y'all, I really need to start keeping some of these for bait. We really start need to keep some of these for bait. Bro, these are like 18 inch ladyfish, I swear. All right. I'm just casting on a school of ladyfish. But where are the. Here we go. There we go. Yeah. Oh, we got a. Is that a croaker? Look at that. Look at that. Mm. Little sand trout. Finally. I mean, it's not a ladyfish. But it's not a damn sheep head. There we go. There we go. It is a sand trout. A little bit bigger. Another sand trout. Let me put it, it's about 13, 33 inches, you know, get that thumbnail. All right. I don't really like sand trout, they're kind of, the meat is mushy, just like they feel. Right. Nice landing, bro. All right, so I may have been too deep. I just readjusted the bobber upwards. So it could be a little better. The dolphins are getting closer. Really close. The birds are, oh, 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 we on, we on. Oh, it's going to the right, going to the right, no, no, no. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Y'all. How did that even happen? <laughs> 